But you gotta be brave enough to step into the ring. Put your guard up and fight back. What was she boiling? If you go back and look at the video, he was the one who told her to um, turn off or like stop boiling whatever she was boiling. And when she picked up the water and he was moving around, she was like, why are you moving around? It's like, because you got that boiling water. That's when she said, oh, I rebuke you. She, what, what was she boiling in this for her to like off rip? No, he has something spiritually going on. And then the way he responded, as soon as she said, I rebuke you, she said it like twice. That's when he got agitated and angry. Like she knew something was there, but she only knew, not like she only knew why, but like she didn't understand or understood like what happened why he felt that way until after she he was like moving away from the boiling water that's what i want to know if someone's saying i rebuke you in the name of jesus offends you to the point you want to kill them you must be the devil because only satan himself or someone possessed with demonic spirits will be that offended by that statement she must have been boiling holy water. She said, I rebuke you in the name of Jesus twice and left. Gone. Execution style. But we're outraged about law? What about God's law? It's the law of inheritance. Glory to our Father God. So where do you stand if you had to stand for God? That's the sermon that didn't have to be preached when you watch the video. That's not a celebration. We're, we're just going to focus on the fact that like, oh, it wasn't fair. It's never going to be fair. What does it mirror? Hmm. No crime was committed. And they took and life was taken. Does that reflect anyone that anyone is reading about in their Bible? We are an extension of him. Because I've chosen you out of the world, the world hates you. And if they hate you, just remember that they hated me first. So do you see that only a closeness in a relationship with God and a relationship and not a routine in your Bible is what's going to show you the truth. Even when the news is telling you the news is still not telling you the good news. Which is Jesus Christ is on the way. Which is Jesus Christ is the only way. Which is those who seek to save their lives will lose them. But those who lose them for his name's sake will gain them eternally. Glory to God. That's, that's the God we serve. So what are you preparing for? What are you prepping for? What are you practicing for? To save your life or to lose it? Breathe, yes. Now we're gonna headshot wounded the female. Headshot wounded the female. Ten seventy eight. 